How you doing everybody? This is Danny of Home HT Reviews and right now we're going to have a review of one of the most anticipated 2011 Claws Tamashii Nation exclusive and this is the Saint Seiya Myth Claws and this is the Galaxian Wars Fake Sagittarius Myth Claws. It is made by Bandai and the silver sticker signifying as original. And it comes from Hong Kong. So this is a replica of the fake Sagittarius Myth Cloth. And this is the one they did as a replica for the Sagittarius Cloth. So here we have the front shot of the figure or the fake cloth. As you can see very bulky. And then you have the object mold which you could you see it most of the time in the series. You have the Bandai logo on the corner. Then you have the silver sticker of Hong Kong on the side and this was made in 2011. This myth cloth is a solid type of package and this opens from the side now which is a uh, first for a myth cloth line. So it opens from the side this way and you could see it says St. Cloth Myth Sagittarius Cloth but remember this is the fake version. On the back it shows you how it would look on the object mode and they show you how to put it on the figure itself and then they showed you it has a uh, faces for Iki Phoenix and then it has a black face just to put it with the cloth itself and I like this black thing on the corner like I said most of the time it says Sagittarius cloth on the side so that is enough of the box review let's go to the package review and see how the package looks so looking at the package as you could see right away it is a very heavy cloth. As soon as I took it out, I could feel the weight on the package. So as you can see, there's a helmet, there's the extra face for Ike Phoenix, and then we have the solid black body, and you can see everything is very blocky. As you can see, there's the chest, side skirts, parts of the arms, parts of the hands, the legs. Very, very blocky figure. It is two plates on this figure, but they're all both on top of each other so let's go with plate B on plate B you could see this is humongous this is the object mode parts and you could see there's the shoulders part of the top of the thing then we have parts of the arms the arrow as you keep going down it just looks beautiful the object mode does look massive so that is great let's go with the manual so here we have the manual of the Thomas Nation uh, Sagittarius fake cloth exclusive and you can see there's three colors there's pink there is yellow and there is green some parts and then you have your standard blue and white and it shows you how to put the object mode together and how to put the figure mode together it has a little a lot of chunky parts so I don't think it's gonna be that difficult to put on so you look at the object mode and then from there we're gonna go with the figure but I'll probably display this figure as object mode because that's the only way I saw him in the anime. So let's see that right now.
So here we have the fake Sagittarius cloth already put in his human form. As we saw the object mode, the object mode is massive, it's big. And when you put this on the cloth, you could see it's very bulky on the figure. So as you can see, very nice. Uh, the way they used the shoulders, they put one part on top of the other. The, the thing that was really shocking to me is that the actual chest underneath, like right here, is actually plastic, which most uh, chest pieces are actually metal. But what is metal now is the actual shoulders. So the, this part right here and this part right here are plastic with this part in the middle. So what's metal was plastic, so the helmet is all plastic. The part on the top of the shoulders is plastic. This is metal, and this part in the middle and the bottom of the chest is plastic. The hands are die cast metal. This thing right here that looks like the arrow is die cast metal. The hands are plastic, which is really nice to give you two pairs of hands. One shiny and one without. Over here is die cast metal but with this pla this part right here. And this arm is plastic. The skirt is die cast metal with this part right here in the middle is plastic. Die cast metal, die cast metal, die cast metal with the behind part, which is this part right here on the corner. This is plastic, which goes underneath the, the calf or the leg, and the feet is plastic. So, as you can see, really, really nice figure, very solid figure. Very, very nice. Everything looks great on this figure. Um, tall wise, is almost as tall as a normal myth cloth. The object mode is what's massive and what's big. So I'll probably display them in the object mode form. But it's a total 10 out of 10. Very massive, very solid. It is a very heavy figure. And it has a lot of parts. Mostly the parts are for the object mode because the object mode is what shines on this figure itself. But if you want to display them like this, it's totally fine. It's up to you. But the actual winner here and what they were trying to emphasize more is the fake cloth in his object mode how it was being presented to the people of the crowd on the series so yeah I give it a total 10 out of 10 let's go with my final thoughts of this figure so here we are with a Saint Seiya Myth cloth Galaxian War fake Sagittarius cloth made by Bandai and I have to say it is a really really well made cloth it really lived up to my expectations and how it would look in the anime and how it looks now. Uh, the figure human form is great. The actual face for Iki Phoenix that they gave you is a good bonus, but I really don't understand why they have it. But you could put it on this fake cloth, but as you can see, the face is really well made. It's a great bonus, and they give you a lot of features for this. What really shines on this cloth is actual object mode. It is massive and is what they were trying to promote. The human form, it is a great touch, but I've never seen the cloth in human form before. Or maybe it came out like that, but I know the Sagittarius cloth. This cloth itself, it is great. I give it a 10 out of 10. I'm going to display it in this object mode on my collection because that's how it shines the most. This is a Tom Machine Nation exclusive, but right now I shop to go has some in stock. Get yours there today. It's really, really nice. I totally recommend it. If you ever wanted the fake uh, Sagittarius cloth, or if you think it's a really beautiful, it's a really nice pickup. You should totally get it. So I give it a 10 out of 10. You should totally buy this figure. So this has been Daniel from HD Reviews saying, I'll see you on the next Saint Seiya. Review.